children, Charles, Just be it's Games here. Welcome back to the episode of the Pokemon Zeta Randomizer Bravery Run Challenge. In the last episode, we took down the Sith Gym right here in Termora Town. And, uh, well, let's just not talk about that gym ever again because those puzzles, that rotation puzzle, I tried to do it off screen. Uh, uh, that's not happening. Every other puzzle is sufficiently easy. The shine, the sliding puzzle is very easy compared to that rotation puzzle. If you guys can do the rotation puzzle in that gym, let me know in the comment section down below where the hell I'm going wrong with that one because I have no clue how to do that one. And I cannot find a guide on the internet old that would help me because every other Let's Play just does the sliding puzzle like I did last episode. So yeah. Anyway, let's go and so let's see what Team Asgard's doing here. All right, boys. You know the plan. Odin uh, guessed, uh, gone up the mountain and captured, uh, and captured and secured Zarachi for our ultimate plan. So you all know the plan. One with Dur the one with Zarachi and Diviculus and knows how to you. We know how to use them to take over the world. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Dave, are you okay? Of, and of course, as you know that Odin isn't too happy with us for losing to that kid. You know, that kid's standing right here, you know. He he was mad at he's mad at Fro and Loki uh, for and Loki too. Right. He's pretty scary. <laughs> Dave, seriously, what are you saying? As you know, he's already has, he already has Shaman and secured a method of catching Diviculus. If he catches Jirachi, you can imagine how strong he'll be. He'll be terrifying. I wouldn't want that. I wouldn't want to get on his bad side. <laughs> Dave. Ah, oh, forget it. So we need insurance. We need a Pokemon that can be that can't be defeated to protect us. But if he has three legendary Pokemon, how do we, how could an ordinary Pokemon not uh, be able to defeat him? Stop that talk right now. We, we won't try to defeat Odin. He's our leader after all. Then why suggest it? We're only trying to protect ourselves, alright? Not to take Odin down. That's... That's treacherous talk. Who's with me? I? I? Excellent. I'll be meeting you back at our secret base. Team Asgard out! You didn't hear it, anything I care about, but, but I still can't let you go. Tell me, does the smell of... Does this smell like chloroform to you? Oh... Oh dear. We seem to be in some trouble. Uh, can I go... We're here to keep you contained, Mr. Eja. Doesn't want you messing around with her plan. You'll never escape. Really? I'll never escape? Yep. You're saying the exact same thing. Um. Ooh. Gengar, return. Hey, Joanne, remember me? Graham, the gym leader. Graham! Hello! It's been a while, hasn't it? Uh, I came here because Team Asgard were planning to go after... Uh, to go... Planning something in their base. Do you want me to give you a hand? Sure. Awesome. Follow me, then. Shadow Sneak was used. Ah, oh, cool! Shadow Sneak! Freesha and her minions... Up doing something weird, some weird fusion experiment. 
I'll meet you at the top floor where they're doing it, okay? See you in a bit. Hey, nurse. Yes, I'd like to heal my Pokemon. Thank you, nurse. Right. How did you escape? I'm not telling you. Why did I tell you? Why did I tell you how I escaped? I want to kill you. Beacon. No, that's not good for you, Beacon. RTK, would you please take down the Ponyta? Inferno. Okay, that does nothing but it burns. God damn it. Fire spin. This Ponyta's really good. But too bad it's going to get surfed to death. There we go. Okay, what else do you have? A semi seer. Okay, semi seer, the least popular Pokemon of all time. I feel sorry for it, really, when it, you say that, really. But it's not a bad. It's not a bad Pokemon. It just gets a bad rap. And I guess all the uh, the monkey, the elemental monkeys, do really when you think about it. And a Wigglytuff. Um, Kickstart, please come in here. I know I probably should go into Meg, but I really don't want Meg on my team anymore. I need, really need a flying type that would actually... You know, next open route that I'm going to find in Pokemon on, I'm just going to go for it. I'm just going to go and see what happens. I got an itchy nose. I'm just going to go and see if I can find a flying or a rock, psychic, anything that can deal with fighting types. That's what I need now. I'll beat you and prove myself to Mr. Eja. You can try. you got two Pokemon and you start with a Noibat. Cool. I forgot they were. I forgot Noibat was in this game. I like that. Level 41, not bad. And a Spiritomb. You have no weakness. Well, you might have weakness, but I don't have Fairy. So I'm just going to beat you with power. Ominous Wind. That does nothing to me. Beating you with power is really good, actually. It's doing so much... I'm doing so much damage. Oh my god, you got the stat boost. That's not good. But you're paralyzed. Oh, sucker punch. Okay, cool. Right. I see an item. I want the item. I found a max elixir. What do you say now on the other side of you? Nothing, just your text doesn't change. You don't realize that I'm the other side of you. Team Ascot kidnapped me from my family and forced me to work here. If you could beat them, that would be great. I will try. What do you have to say? Team Ascot kidnapped me. Okay, you're the exact same person. You're the exact same as the other guy. I will save them, don't we? Heal me, Nurse Joy. Thank you. You really shouldn't put a healer in your bit in your if you really shouldn't put a healer inside your secret base. Like, that's really a bad idea. If you're gonna like take over the world and then you go and kidnap somebody, really you shouldn't put a healer inside your base. Don't put a healer. Now, evil genius plans number one. Do not put a healer inside your base. Because that means that you, everyone could use that healer, including the person that you don't want healing. I just used Night Slash, didn't I? You don't have a berry, so I'm okay. I got away with that this turn. There you go, Tangler. Level 42 for Beacon. Okay, Flygon. I don't have any Ice-type moves. Well, I know I can't stay in. I know I can't stay in. That's one thing I know right now. I can't stay in. So I'm going into RTK. I guess Surf will have to do. 
Earth power. Ow! And that stab on you. Supersonic. Supersonic miss. Cool. I hate for I got. Screech. Ooh. Can I, can I kill it? Can I kill it? Okay, fine. Stupidity rules overall. I'm going back to a healer. Manti, uh, Beacon, that's you. I'm going to try to get everyone to level 45. I might have to do some grinding in a minute. Well, I might have to do some grinding sometime soon. We'll see. I haven't really needed to grind this whole game, really. It's been, in, it's been kind of well leveled and I haven't really needed to grind. He'll be. This game would be, you know, it doesn't seem like it would be a hard game to Nuzlocke. It just seems like a long game to Nuzlocke. So, yeah, if you played right, you probably could Nuzlocke this. Hello, Mola. Uh, Discharge. Maybe it's because the randomizer, it doesn't seem that bad. Maybe. I don't know. Heat ran. Uh, maybe I'm mistaken about how bad it seems. RTK, can you destroy a heat ran? I really don't want to kill Colossal. I like Colossal. He's a really good. He's a really good mon. I like Colossal the heat ran. I used heat ran so much in, when I was doing leagues. I love heat ran when it's in league play. It just does so much work. But then again, two surfs, not for kill or heat ram. Despite the fact that he leered me twice, I was a little worried about those leers. You've been, yep, you've been kidnapped and taken away from your family. I will save you. Is there anything up here? Okay, let's see what you have. I honestly don't know where I'm going in this base. Grovile. Um, Beacon, you're not the right person for this fight. That's Bidey's turn. The shoot? Ah. Okay, that's fine. It didn't do that much damage after all. Venoshock. I don't like the screech, but Venoshock should kill. Oh, it doesn't kill. I really don't like this, the shoot. But I'm fine with it, because I'm not planning on switching out, so... Level 39, I will take that. And a Spinder. No, I'm still not planning on switching out. No, no, still not planning on switching out. I know you can get Zen Headbutt with Spinder, but the chances of you actually having it, I don't know. I'm going to go for Venoshock again. Oh, I don't like Tita Dance. I don't like Tita Dance. Being confused is not cool. Bye. Bidey. Bidey snaps out of confusion. Bidey use Venom Shock. Bidey kill. Oh, Bidey doesn't kill. Bidey, can you beat him out of sleep? No, fine. I'll heal you up in a minute, Bidey. Go, Meg. Meg use Dizzy Punch. Sucker Punch? Ow. There we go. Nice work, Meg. Still don't fancy evolving yet, do you? After all these levels, I mean, I'm still saying I might bin you if, like... Because I'm not getting a little punny out of this. I know of that. And I'd rather have some kind of flying type or psychic type or, like... Possibly even a ghost would work, really. I mean, Miss... Miss Magnus would be a mate. Well, I don't know about Miss Magnus, but it doesn't learn a lot of HMs. Unless uh, they've made it learn HMs. But, uh, well, if they've made it learn some good moves, then Miss Magnus could be a good Pokemon. It's a shame that in the last two previous runs that they, you know, they made Miss Magnus a good Pokemon. 
Meluetta. I'm gonna power jam you. Oh, that does nothing. Oh my god, that does nothing. Um, I don't think you're gonna have T. I don't think you're gonna have that relic song. You can't hit me with that. I'm gonna night slash you. Echo voice. Ow. There we go. Legendaries are still scary. Doesn't matter which ones they are. They're just still scary. Now Porygon Z. I still say Z. I still say Porygon Z instead of Porygon Z. But Porygon Z doesn't sound right. I mean, I'm not American in any way, shape, or form, but just Porygon Z just doesn't sound right. It sounds right to say Porygon Z in that situation. Jump kick did well. I don't think you're living in this shot. It's a crit. See what I mean about the fact that I'm not getting a little punny? I am not getting a little punny. Just simple as that, really, when you think about it. I am not getting a little punny. I really would like a little punny because I've been working my ass off with Meg, but the fact is I'm not getting a little punny. It's just not happening. So there's just no way in hell I'm getting a little punny. So really, I want to bin Meg at the next open route. If you guys want me to keep Meg on the team, let me know in the comment section down below. But really, I want to bin Meg. If I could take Meg and then take Meg, throw Meg away and then put a Pidgeot on my team. Hell, I'd even put that Tranquil on my team. It's in my PC right now. But then again, Tranquil sucks. It is the worst Route 1 bird. And I'd rather have something like Pidgeot. Ivysaur. Beacon, you can't beat an Ivysaur. Um, let's go into let's go into uh, Bidey. Double Edge. Ah, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. Ooh, that's uh, that's kind of uh, I don't like the synthesis. I really don't like the synthesis. By the way. Okay, that's doing some damage. Don't like the growth. Really don't like the growth. Can you like not growth? It would be good if you didn't growth. A seismitoad. Uh, Zenny. That's your domain. Seed bomb? Yeah, seat bomb the seismitoad. Seismitoads are very scary. I tried to use one. I tried to use one in the PDK a few months back, but they're, kind of, they're actually really interesting mons. They don't get a lot of love in their like league play and stuff like that, but they're really quite interesting mons. I wouldn't mind using the seismitoad again sometime. I might have to try and build a team for it. And Swaddle. I'm not worried about Swaddle. Rock slide. Oh, you... You live a rock slide? Okay. But I missed. Struggle bug. Okay, my special attack fell, but I don't really need my special attack. My physical attacker. There we go. DM75, sword stance. Nice. I kind of want to go to move deleter at the end of this episode as well, and uh, what do I want to get? I want to get waterfall onto uh, RTK, because waterfall's physical, and of course RTK Crawdunt is a physical attacker, so it would be a good idea to have Crawdunt with physical attacks. Don't let the curse, but take this goal look. There's only one Iron Giant, and that's in black and white. A Scroopy. 
I can stay in against a Skaroopy. I'm not. I don't think that can do too much to me. I'm still affected by this curse, aren't I? The curse is kind of like badly poisoned, isn't it? Oh, can I have live? I can live one more. I can live one more curse. Take this surf and die, it's like a rupee. Nice. Okay. Game's a bit glitchy. I'm gonna go and uh, I'm gonna go and heal then. Game is being a bit glitchy. I'm gonna go and heal and sort this out. Right, now when I go back up there, it shouldn't be glitchy, hopefully. Because if the game's glitchy, that's not good. That might mean that my, I might have to save and switch off. And I kind of would like to get this done today. There we go. It's fine now. It's up here. I know you can get, I think... I think I swear I saw you could get a Master Ball in this game. From this area. Oh, I don't want to kill it. I don't want to kill it, because it's back. I want to leave it alone, but, like, it's on the other side of the pitch. I'm sorry, back. Cast form. Oh, I don't mind killing this thing. This thing can just die like so much this thing needs to, like die and then die again and die again because this thing just sucks why would anyone want a cast form i mean yeah sure it can put up weather but like it just doesn't like i swear nobody can use this thing as an actual proper mon and rtk can you please finish off this uh lunatone with a uh, surf Heal block. Okay, fine. I'm not allowed to heal well anymore. Fine. I don't need a heal. I don't need to heal. Once Surf kills... Well, once Surf puts you in a very strange situation, which Night Slash will just finish you in no matter what HP you're at. It doesn't matter how many cosmic powers up you have. You're dead. Bye-bye, Lunato. Is there anything down here? Looks empty. Maybe I missed something in the base. Okay, that's completely a dead end then. Thanks. Okay. This place is a maze. This is not good, and I still have an itchy nose. Sableye. Well, you have no weakness again. Just like the spirit in my face earlier. So just power is the best thing I can do against you. Oh, it's a crit! Oh my god, this charge is doing so much damage. Wish cash. Zenny, come on out here and deal with the wish cash. I can't deal with that wish. I can't deal with that. C bomb the wish cash. Oh, I love it. wish cash is pretty cool. Why are you resting? Like I haven't hit you yet. Now you need to rest, but you're dead. Level 43. Nice. And done. I'm not worried about it. I mean, I'd be even less worried if uh, if we could learn a fighting type move with Zenny, but I don't even know when Zenny learns fighting type moves. I swear, I do not know when Chestnut learns a fighting type move. I need to look up Chestnut's moveset. Because Chestnut should learn fighting type moves. It should have learned at least one by now. Maybe, do, maybe there's a relearning move I can... Like, if I had a heart scale, maybe I could do something with it then. What's up here? This is a moving staircase powered by a generator in another room. Huh. Fine. Damn travelators. I'll find a way past you. You can run up a travelator. This is... This is gladi- this is- it's not gladiators, is it? It's not gladiators. Damn, I can't run up the travelator. 
If you you probably wouldn't know what I'm talking about if you're American or if you're a kid. Like you've probably never seen gladiators. That's a horrible life that you must be living if you've never seen Gladiators. I swear, like, go on the internet right now. Go on YouTube and pause this video and go and look up Gladiators. Because Gladiators is amazing. I'm pretty sure you can find the British version of Gladiators on the US version of YouTube. But Gladiators was such a... Saturday night eights were just so good when I was a kid. The entertainment you could get on a Saturday night. I remember, like, every week I used to sit down from... I used to get home from my nans, and I used to be able to sit and watch things like uh, Big Break, which was a snoo a game show about snooker, which again, probably a thing Americans don't really know too much about is snooker. Oh my god, I I don't really play and watch snooker, but the fact is, I love Big Break. Big Break was a very good show. And then, of course, afterwards, you'd switch over to the other, you'd switch over to ITV, when, and you'd have, and then Gladiators was on straight afterwards, and it was good. Glaceon. Rage mode! That's Saturday Night Entertainment for you. The way it's supposed to be. Like, Saturday nights these days are just like four talent shows on British television, like X Factor and Britain's Got Talent. Oh my god, they're so annoying. I hate talent shows. Um. Right. Let's talk to you again. Frieza said I'm gonna I'm gonna be fired. So I'm just drinking my feelings away. Um It's gonna be okay. I know, can I tell you my life story? Sure, why not? I grew up in a small town of Verizon. Verizon. No one knew where uh, no one knew who I was until I met Professor Oak. Shall I continue? Yes. He offered me a Pokemon and to go on an adventure. But I arrived too late. I got the fourth Pokemon, a disheartened electric one. Are you Ash? Are you Ash? Because you sound like you are Ash. We eventually bonded and I... Uh, but I took... Uh, but it took a long time. Shall I continue? Yes. We fought many enemies together. We rescued legendary Pokemon and even saw myths come true, like the famous the forms of in the forms of Mewtwo and Arceus. I even fell in love with a girl, a water gym leader, and a store with a Stormy. We eventually got married and had a kid. Good. We fell on hard times. We divorced, and I joined Team Asgard to make ends meet. Do you know who I am? What's the first letter of my name? A? Hmm. So you know who I am. What's the second letter of my name? S? So what's the third letter of my name? H? Ash. You're Ash. You know who I am. And I was the once world-renowned Ash. Catch him. Now leave me to die. Dr leave me drinking. Uh, but I'll give you this as a reward. TM68 Giga Impact. I feel sorry for you, Ash. I really do. I hope you find you. I hope you find Misty and get your kid back. Because I feel bad for. Like Ash is not a bad trainer, by the way, ladies and gentlemen. And everyone keeps on saying Ash is a bad trainer, but I don't believe it one bit. Ash is a good trainer. He's tactical, and the Pokemon anime is completely different to how the video games work. One of these days, I will play Pokemon Ash Grey on the channel, because that's the closest video game aim to the actual how the anime series works, and I might actually do that in 2017. Yeah, so there you go. There's, another L There's an LP I might be doing in 2017. Actually, yeah, I would not mind doing Ash Grey on this channel. With the orange tiles and everything, that'd be awesome. You know what? Let me, let me know in the comment section down below if you'd want to see Ash Gray on this channel. Because I would love to do that. I would love to do that. Catching Ash's team. Uh, evolving Ash's team. Well, uh, playing the way Ash would. And also, I might try like two different series with that, chat, with that series. You know, I play one way, the way Ash did. And then... 
And then I play the other way with way uh, the way I would play it with Ash's mons, literally evolving them when they're supposed uh, when I want them to evolve and making sh them strong as hell. Well, that just sounds like an interesting LP to play. Just like you play one way, you play as Ash would, and then you play as you would with Ash's Pokemon. I mean, I can't lock it. I can't do it. There's no such thing as an Ash lock. Actually, there might be, but like, I'm not going. I wouldn't lock. I wouldn't lock Pokemon Ash Gray because the fact is, it doesn't seem right to lock a game that's based on the anime. Because you're supposed to catch certain Pokemon at certain times, and it doesn't seem right to say, "Hey, I'm going to catch something else instead." But I'm going. Oh, this Pokemon's dead, but like, it's not dead because like that wouldn't happen in real life. Damn. I sort of thought I could beat the Drift Lun. Bidey, come on in here and finish this. Night Slash. Shadow Pulse. Ow. Okay. Drift Lun. I'm not. Oh my god, this Drift Lun wants to kill me. Ponyta. RTK, would you mind coming in here and dealing with the Ponyta? I know where you. I know you're really bad HP right now, but I think you can handle this. I'll go. I think I might go and uh, go back to the healer. Go back to Nurse Joy in a minute. Nice. Level forty-two. Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to Nurse. I'm gonna go back to Nurse Joy. I could probably cut this bit out, but I don't want to. I think I know where I'm going now. Just need to go up those stairs and everything should be fine. I don't know where, like, I don't know where I'm going. Like, is this the room with the gen... Is the room I'm heading to got the generator? Or is the room I'm heading to just got uh, the other person? The, the Galactic League the leader of this team, Asgard's leader, Faresha. If she's here, then that would be pretty good. But she could also... Uh, we could be having um, the room with a generator in, which would allow me to go to the other room, where she might be. But honestly, I don't really know. So we will honestly see what's around here. What's up here, then? Oh! My friends, Odin. Uh, my friends, Odin has already left to Top Mount Press, waiting for Jirachi to appear. Once we have Jirachi, he can catch Dravikulus, and the world will fall at our feet. Back to our master plan. Good. Finally. <laughs> uh, what is our master plan? Never mind that now. The point is. Can you imagine how powerful Odin would be with uh, three legendary Pokemon? That's a scary thought. Wow. <laughs> we need to return. Uh, we need to uh, be able to defend ourselves. We need a Pokemon that Odin cannot defeat. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever he says. Hold on a minute. Isn't that mutiny? Odin is our leader. And he's very kind to us. Well, completely, uh, compared to, like, Giovanni, Ar Archie, and those guys, you can't betray him. What are you implying, Varisha? No, no, I, I, I didn't mean anything like that. See, uh, lately, Odin hasn't been too happy with us. After I lost in Omega, well, Megatown, throw losing... In Freeze, Fianga, and them together losing in Lucida. Well, a mad boss with the sub-divine Pokemon, semi-divine Pokemon, is a, isn't a good combination. I guess so, but what do you propose? What Pokemon can stand against the three legendaries? Well, these two Pokemon, we have world reopened. Sableye has no weaknesses. And Shininja, the fabulous Pokemon with the Wonder Guard ability. 
as you know, Wonder Guard allows you to uh, take damage for only types you're weak to. If we can fuse these two mons together in some sort of way, Sableye gains the Wonder Guard ability. We'd have invincible Pokemon. Exactly. Now, ready the machine. Now, on my arch. Colette. Ugh, not the Elite Four again. That's right. And it's not just me. Joanne, come out. Joanne. Ugh. I want my revenge for what happened in One Mega Town. If you win, we'll stop this experiment. But if I win, you become a Team Asgard Grunt and serve me forever. Let's go. Okay. Okay, Faresia. I'll take these. I will take you on. You start with an Ambipom. Uh, I would probably be better off for Kickstart. And we'll end this episode as soon as we're done here. Because I've realised we've almost gone 40 minutes again. God damn it, i gotta keep, I got to keep a timer near me. This double hit's annoying. Is this Brickbait going to kill? Oh yeah, that's a crit. Okay, cool. Bye bye, Abby Pom. Cotton Guard. No, you're fine. Yeah. Cedra. Uh, let's go into Beacon. Yeah, I think I should be okay with this fight. Uh, discharge? Yeah, Discharge. Drister is the worst dragon type move ever. Discharge should kill. Oh, yeah. Nice. I gotta take that. I gotta take that away from you now. You don't need that lucky egg anymore. I'll take that off you off screen. And a mud care. Uh, discharge. Because you're not water ground yet. There you go. And a Tranquil. Oh, I can feel that too. I know exactly what I'm dealing with. Your sucky Pokemon. Level 47 for Beacon. Awesome. No, Odin won't be happy. No, impossible. You can't. Quickly, my... Beacons, Force Sableye and Ninja. Not quite, Freezer. Go, Emperos. Emperos, use Thunder. Shut down this system. Wah! No, the fusion machine's been shut off. You two, you two will pay for this. You'll never escape this room. I would disagree. Graham, you two. Why does everyone hate me? Colette, Joanne, let's get out of here. Shadow Sneak. Well, that, that was fun. Are you okay? You seem to have a adverse reaction to Shadow Sneak. You were nearly out You were nearly out for 20 minutes. Colette's, Poke, Colette's gone back to the Pokemon League. You have a duty to... She to stop Odin at the top of Mount Press. But I... I would accompany you, but I have a gym to manage. Understand? Before you go, I recommend you search this base in its entirety. There may be many rare items and different things that you might be found here for sure. I wouldn't be surprised if they had a master ball here some ways. Anyways, I'll be off. I wish I could I wish you the best of luck. I am proud to call you a friend. Goodbye, Joanne. May we meet again. Okay, I'm gonna head back to you know what? No, I'm not going to head back. I was going to head back. But no, I want that Master Ball. I think I know where it is. It's up here. And up here. And it's up this staircase too. There's a PC here. 
Um, I don't know if I want to go through there. Maybe the master pulls down the other, uh, that, down that dead end. I want to see what's down this dead end here. Let's go up here then. Looks empty. Maybe I missed something in the base. But there's no master ball. But there's no master ball. Maybe we can go back up to the fusion room. Uh, yeah, I'm probably going to end up leaving off this episode right here because I don't really know where I'm going. I really don't know where I'm going. This is the fusion room again. Yeah, I really don't know where I'm going. So, you know what? I'm going to leave off this episode here. I'm guessing up that other room. That, ever, that other room. The one up here with the PC in it. Leads you up. Uh, leads you somewhere. Yeah, it leads you up to the top of Route 310. I don't want to deal with that just yet. But anyway, I'm going to leave off this episode here. Off screen, I'm going to try and find that Master Ball. And until next time, I'm just PH Games, and I am out. See you again.